My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. Got a gorgeous 1967 Mustang convertible here. Now I'm gonna throw some important letters at you. It's an S code GT. Well, the S code, there's an S in the VIN number that designates that's a 390 big block motor. And of course the GT is the performance package and the styling package from the fog lamps and the louvered hood and the exhaust coming out through the valance. It also has a very desirable deluxe interior. Uh, power top, it's got a lot of great things going for it. Really nice car. Same owner the last 13 years. He's had the car maintained by Mustang Restoration, so it's been in their shop, on their lift, uh, and they've inspected and maintained the car for him. Go to volocars.com. That's where you can read all the information, study all the pictures. You will find a price tag on this car and every other car that we have for sale, along with a monthly finance option. That's at volocars.com. If you enjoy these videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on that bell icon, that way you're notified as the new ones are posted. But for right now, that tops down, let's go for a spin. This has the Marty Report. Uh, that's right off of Ford's microfilm from back in the day. You give them the VIN number and $55, and they tell you how this car was born. So it is a documented, genuine S-Code GT Mustang convertible. Uh, underneath the car, uh, none of it's like brand new, but it, it's all fresh. Maybe it was restored 15 years ago or maintained as needed, but the front end components, the bushings, the ball joints, uh, the power steering control valve, all that is clean. Uh, it's got Coney gas shocks all around. Uh, the fuel tank's been replaced. Disc brakes in front. You can see the hoses and the brake lines are, are clean. They've been replaced. The e-brake assembly is hooked up. It does have a real nice dual exhaust system with a crossover pipe, Flowmaster mufflers, and then these quad GT tips coming right out through the lower valance. You look up at the motor, it's clean. The starter, the fuel pump, it's all clean components. It's a C6 automatic, that's Ford's heavy duty automatic transmission. It's clean. Uh, came with a 336 Posi rear end. They call it Equilock. That's their uh, way of calling it a Posi, Ford's version of it. Uh, the floors, frame rails, all that's real solid, all clean metal. So underneath the car, uh, looks like it's been completely restored. Not yesterday, but uh, not that long ago either. It looks very good. Not many miles on it since it's been done. Now the body itself, uh, the hood, the fenders, this is all straight and in good shape. Like I said, it has the louvered uh, hood with turn signals built in. All fits real well. Side of the car is really straight and you know it's black. It's going to not hide anything. Uh, this all lines up nice. There are no bubbles down here. It's all nice and smooth and clean. So the body's looking really good. This is all straight. That trunk lid fits perfectly square and flush. This side's just as straight. Lines up real nice. No bubbles. I'm going to call the body excellent. Uh, he bought the car already painted, so it's at least 13-year-old paint job. If it was going to have <clears throat> things starting to pop or show, it would be doing it by now. Now, the actual paint, it's raven black, it's beautiful, it's a mirror finish, it's gorgeous. But when you inspect it, you'll find flaws. There's a scratch right here. And the black is fairly easy to touch up. It's black. It's not a metal flake color. Um, but this is all smooth and glossy. Of course, it has the white GT stripes uh, down low. Those are stickers. Here's a scratch that's been touched up, a, a nick, I should call it, a little nick here. Uh, so there's some imperfections. There's some swirls in the hood that could be buffed a little better right there. A couple of little rock chips up here in the front. And there's a scratch 
on this back corner. Same on both sides. A little nick right here. So a couple minor imperfections, but man, this thing is slick. It's beautiful. It, it shows when you walk up to it, it looks perfect. Uh, being a GT, it has the fog lamps in the grill. They're all sparkling, the running horse. All of this, I'm sure, has been replaced. The bumper, all that's in beautiful shape. It has a power antenna. I turn the key on, the antenna goes up. Uh, crystal clear windshield, the rubber gasket. I'm sure all that's been replaced. This is all real nice. Got like one little dink right there. The vent window frame is really clean. The rubber is soft. The rubber seals are soft. Door handle's been replaced. It's a black convertible top. You'll see pictures on our website. It's a power top. Oh, sorry, it's a white top. My bad. I'm checking to see if it has a glass window or plastic. I can't. It's a glass two-piece window. So it's a white uh, convertible power top. Tail lights, bumper, GT gas cap, the pop-up, pop-out gas cap trim all that looks like it's been replaced and uh, sitting on some polished torque thrust wheels Goodyear tires I'm trying to find the size they're 16 inch uh, tires and wheels remote mirrors in real nice shape that's been replaced so let's open it up let's see what it's like under the hood and I'll show you what a deluxe interior is Pops right open like a charm. Uh, but anyway, it's all nice solid metal in here. It's been uh, like spatter painted. Uh, it has the complete liner kit. It has a new well liner. Uh, in this Mustang bag, it has uh, the spare tire cover. Obviously, there's no spare in here. If you do get one, there's a matching cover. And under the trunk lid in the jam, it's painted very nicely. Weather strip looks like new. One of those bags in the trunk is also for the uh, top boot. <clears throat> so the door jams are nice. The weather strips are real nice. That's the deluxe interior I mentioned. See the stainless trim on the door panel, the molded door panel, the lights working at the bottom. That's part of the deluxe package. It's kind of a big deal in a Mustang and the deluxe interior. And across the whole dash has the brush stainless trim all these bezels and chrome all looks great this has the optional tachometer factory tack the dash pads real nice all real nice lights work kick panels are real nice got the owner's manual in here this is called the garage door and you can see there's a custom auto sound stereo in here a modern stereo so you can plug in your Apple device. Um, there's a remote control for it. You can just leave out here and control it. But this whole center console, it's a deluxe console. It looks new. Look at it all sparkling. Uh, seat belts look like they're reproduction too. Down on the floor, we got nice carpet, pony mats. The seats feel like they've got uh, been re-cushioned, re-upholstered. The deluxe upholstery is a little different. The deluxe seat also has these hard plastic backs. This one does have one crack in it right here. <clears throat> so the back seat's real nice. He has children, so they put in the retractable shoulder belts to make it safer for him. But this is all reupholstered, all looks really nice. Steering wheel, too, all looks new, the chrome. It's in great shape. Visors are replaced. So very, very nice interior. Interior lights are working. When I mention the interior lights work, it's not well, a big deal, interior lights work, but it's just one of those things that tells you a little bit about the car. If those are working, then generally someone cared and took care of stuff like that and kept it maintained. So there's the, the big engine. Uh, we got power steering and power brakes, very desirable options. Uh, and overall, very good shape. The air cleaner, the valve covers, the manifolds, it all looks stock. The metal engine bay is clean. The fender bolts are clean. 
There are some reproduction hoses. There's a crack in the fan shroud right there. That could, that could still be glued. Uh, horns are new. We got the washer bottle. Uh, everything just looks tidy, proper, nice. Look at how that brake booster barely fits with this big engine in here. Under the hoods painted nice. You know what, this is a very nice car. Here are that trunk click shut, that door click shut, the interior lights work, fit and finish is really nice. GT, big block, you got the stereo, you got the seat belts for the kids. Uh, this is just a nice weekend car, ready to go cruise, yet it's an investment uh, grade vehicle as well. Go to volocars.com. That's where you can talk to the salesman. I just gave you my impression. Uh, salesman can help answer questions. They'll help get this delivered to your door. They'll help you finance it at volocars.com. Hopefully you're enjoying these videos. Subscribe and then click on that bell icon so you can be the first to see the next one posted. Thanks for watching.